Did you know that climate change has such a wide array of effects on our planet that even my favorite activity, baking banana bread, is being threatened? Let's talk about it. But you may be thinking, bananas grow in a tropical climate, right? So global warming shouldn't be affecting them. Wrong. Although temporarily, climate change has been good for banana production, as global warming has been causing growing zones to expand, this same temperature trend could cause banana production to drop by 2050. Another thing that climate change has increased is the threat of extreme weather events. Hurricanes and flooding can damage and kill banana plants, as well as infrastructure and civilians living nearby. And if that wasn't bad enough, an increasingly warm and damp climate can help with the proliferation of diseases which could wipe out our beloved bananas as we know it. So the bananas are in danger, but what about the bread? Great question, Jordan. Actually, like with bananas, increasing temperatures are temporarily increasing productivity for wheat by expanding growing zones. Although, increasing CO2 from emissions is actually decreasing the nutritional quality of this wheat. And this is really bad for the consumer. Okay, just to further expand on that last point a little, because I think it's really interesting, one of the main reasons why some plants will contain less nutrients per unit of plant is not that the rate of mineral storage is decreasing, but if you look to part A in the top left of this image, you'll see that it's the rate of photosynthesis and growth that's increasing and diluting the plant since there's more atmospheric CO2 available. Plants are growing larger and they're growing faster than normal, so the mechanisms in the plant that handle mineral storage are not keeping up. Another issue is that droughts are going to become worse in the future, in contrast to humanity's growing demand for water. Right now, 15% of wheat growing areas face severe water scarcity crises, but this will increase to 60% by the end of the century. Climate change is also negatively impacting the efficiency of overseas shipping from delays caused by extreme weather or droughts affecting waterways. Well, that all sounds kind of scary. There is some good news. Let's talk about it. It turns out scientists love banana bread just as much as me, since there's multiple researchers looking to genetically modify banana plants to make them resistant or immune to major diseases. Additionally, there are those working to use selective breeding to produce wheat crops which are more resistant to the dry and hot conditions that we're starting to see more prevalent year after year. Really one of the main issues regarding climate change is the actual implementation of mitigation and adaptation strategies. So while you may feel that there's nothing you can do on a grand scale, remember that everyone holds power in their votes. This is a human-caused issue, so let's make it human-solved for the sake of continuing the beautiful practice of baking sweet, sweet banana bread.